This is a family case where we get to play as a member of the Klaus family. This story happened to me one July morning. This letter stated that my mother, Jennifer Blackwood, died suddenly. Now I'm in sole heir to the Blackwood mansion. These events threw me into confusion because I didn't even know my mother because I grew up in an orphanage. Oh. All my attempts to find out something about my parents have always led me to a dead end, but now this letter is the key to the answers to all my questions that I've kept throughout my life. I don't care what the truth is. All I want to know is why my parents left me. I, I can understand completely, you know, wanting to find out the truth or something like that. But I have a sneaky suspicion it's probably done for his benefit. Where we are going to discover oh so terrifying truth behind all family history. Oh, I'm missing a bear. Yeah, this has got the definite Resident Evil, like, puzzles and vibes and... Well, that means we get a badass shotgun, so F all this up. Okay, nope. Dear Mr. Blackwood, as agreed, I stopped by inside to pick up the necessary documents, but I did not find them, as some rooms were locked. Tomorrow, I would go to the morgue and examine your mother's personal belongings. I think the keys should be there. I'll contact you after lunch. Sincerely, Jacob Millet. Okay, well. Thanks, Jacob. Matches, cool. Needed those to light the fireplace. This house is definitely giving me a weird, creepy vibe. Oh, these doors close automatically. Cool. Uh, I guess I do need wood. Well, you'd think they keep it in a room next to the fireplace. God, this is a big property. All right, so I'm just getting like the the feel for things, so to speak. Oh, there's the wood. Firewood. Hey, we got it. That's locked. Yeah, this is definitely giving me a Resident Evil kind of vibe. Which is kind of funny because, you know, Resident Evil 4 Remake just came out. I don't know. Have you played it? I've played the original. I haven't played the remake yet. Probably will end up playing it. I just don't know if I'll put it on the channel. But if you want to see it on the channel, let me know. And I will definitely don't mind adding it. What the hell? Why am I looking at my hands like that? Is it something wrong? Or am I... Okay, I don't know about a candle being there. Or blood being on the walls. Like, what the hell? Whoa, this place got... Yes, like, what happened to the house? This place got trashed. Blood everywhere. <laughs> hell no. What the hell? Okay, so the crap begins. Holy hell. Oh, that is a corpse. That is a corpse. Holy crap. What the hell? There's a brain and everything. Whose corpse is that? What the hell happened? How did all this change when I was napping and I didn't wake up? We're gonna we're gonna have to be careful around here. God, and I only have a little candle. What's with all these strange drawings too? That is, is that off the wall? I don't know if that's supposed to be like that, but it looks like it's not actually on the wall. Take that, doesn't have candles in it. Okay, I guess we have to go to the second floor. It's the only part of the house I haven't been to. There's a body on the face, so I can't imagine what the second's gonna have. Okay. We have to do this methodically. <laughs> okay, you bastard. Medical history, patient Lily Krauss, age 12 years old. Uh, the patient was admitted with complaints of high fever, 
migrating pains throughout her body, nausea, and profuse vomiting. Sounds, kind of sounds like the exorcist. Persia. Okay. Call John tomorrow too, okay? Well, you're not calling anybody because, you know, you passed. Sorry. Yeah, what the hell was that? That was, that was definitely some exorcist type crap walking on the walls and all spider lady like that. I'll pass. Like, thank you. I want nothing to do with that. Well, don't close the door on me, you bastard. Damn. Okay, well, first jump skill got me. I'm hopeful that the rest won't, but I know better that they will. Ooh, this is a bathroom. Bathrooms are not good. I I do not like the doors closing. They cannot close. Oh, God, I. Okay. Just as I was talking about the second jump scare not gonna get me. It did. Okay, well freaking done. Ooh. Okay, stalk game. You you definitely know how to throw those jump scares because I was not expecting crap to come out the window since I'm gonna be frank with you. gonna be ass. Yep, yep, ah, I freaking knew it. Oh, I knew it. This is going to be ass. What the hell? God in this photo. Bonnie Edward Adams. What the hell, man? What were you keeping in? Oh! I have a feeling I can't help you. So or not that was popular like a year ago and, like it was chasing you based on noise oh i can't remember what it was called Nerves are gonna be shot today. I can tell you. Oh, it's one of those games. Okay, so, dude, dude, and dude. Ha! It took me a minute to figure it out. Oh, hey, look, it's a, it's a bear. Granted, you know my luck with bears. If you watch my last video with Winnie the Pooh, yeah, my luck with bears has not been good uh, at the moment. What's going to happen when we put this piece in? And what's the fuse for? I don't even remember seeing anything needing a fuse. Oh, hey, look, a key. Combination lock key? What the hell? Okay, does it go here? Oh, I do not know what the code is. Uh... No idea what the code is. Does anything here show numbers? 
Oh, uh, these do show numbers. 18, 1785, 1940. None of these. These probably different generations, but none of these are giving me a hint as to the numbers. What about the painting here? Nothing. Nothing at all. No numbers on the evil writing. I could like brute force my way, but that would take forever. Okay, so I have electrical fuse. Let's start there. Start with what I do have versus what I don't. Where would the fuse box go? The inside of the house, but I have a sneaky suspicion we won't get that lucky. Nor do I think we'll get lucky enough that we can escape from the backyard. And uh, I don't know what that code is. Wow, there's a lot of different codes here. You all are expecting me to be able to solve all these puzzles? That is some high expectations indeed. Is that Cthulhu? What the hell? A weird statue. And that needs a key. Okay, well. Nothing back here. This is a weird little empty spot. Oh, uh, I can run. Well, hey, at least there's that. I mean, there's a lot of drinking and adult beverages going on over here. Granted, if I lived in this house too, I feel like I'd be drinking a lot too, so I can't really judge. <sighs> can it all? Ooh, there we are. Caution. Instead, all four of the fuses in order to complete the circuit. Okay. We found the fuse box, so this was light. Anything else over here? No. Oh, there we are. Four, six, seven, two. Four, six, seven, two. Oh, it's not gonna be the easy one when they blow stuff. Four. That's 832, so 42. Oh, so 7, 4, 2, 6, 7, 4, 2, 6, 7, 4, 2, 6, 6, 7, 2. Oh, why? 6, 7, 2, 4. I don't get how they. Square flames, maybe? Yeah, I don't get how that... Why was that sequence, but okay. It works. I don't have to understand it. We got past it. Doctor said that the treatment does not help. Lily is getting worse every day. So that is Lily, maybe. I don't know what will help us. We tried all the options of traditional medicine, but it did not lead to anything. Today, our neighbor, Miss Dawson, Brought some herbal tea and gave them to Lily. She immediately felt better. I don't know what it is, but it really works. Miss Dawson appeared in our city about six months ago. We don't know each other well, even though she lives next door. After learning about our sorrow, she said she could help us. Be careful of the old lady with the herbs. Today, Lily's worse again. Herbal tea no longer helps. Miss Dawson said that there was something that could definitely help us and brought a wooden idol. She said that this Asian deity is a relic of her family and a rite of purification from the disease should be performed. God, I'm tired. I don't care what to do anymore. I'm ready to believe everything that can help get Lily better. That can help to Lily get better. Says, Bother me. Today, Miss Dawson performed a purification rite. After that, she handed us a wooden idol and said that we should protect it. What can happen to this piece of wood? This is unlikely to help. Our family is in the lap of the god. Amanda and I pray every day, Lily weekend after the ritual and slept all day. That looks...
looks like a little Cthulhu type idol. I can't believe it. Lily is getting better right before our eyes. The pain passed and she got an appetite. She has never eaten so goodly the buns that Amanda bakes. This is some kind of miracle. Even the color of her skin has become healthy. If this purification right really helped, then we are deeply in Miss Dawson's debt. I don't know, that looks a little too convenient to be true. It is unlikely that I will keep this diary. Lily is completely healthy. All the tests are normal, and the doctors are surprised. They do not understand what is happening because Lily's disease is incurable. But the child is completely healthy. We can't tell anyone about this right. Ms. Dawson warned us that everything must remain secret. And who will believe us? Doctors are people of science, not superstition. Oh, I can always see the pictures stuff getting worse. Something strange has been happening to Lily lately. She became very aggressive. Today, my daughter killed our cat. I noticed that after the fight, it was as if she had been replaced. Even the look has changed. Sometimes I'm scared to look into her eyes as if it's not Lily looking at me from them. But something terrible. Some evil that hides my daughter's body. I met Father Crawford secretly at church today. I told him everything that was happening to us. Even that Lily had killed a man? Whoa, that escalated from a cat to a man. She chewed out the throat of Miss Jane. Who helped us around the house and then smeared all the walls in her room with her blood. Father Crawford promised not to inform the police and to come to us tonight. He suspects that the purification rite of Lily was actually a ritual of diabolizing. Father Crawford said he could help us, and then I have to tell the sheriff everything. God help us. Holy hell, what kind of crap is going on here? The fears were confirmed. A terrible evil lives in Lily's body. Father Crawford does not yet know what kind of demon this thing said Lily. And to expel it, you need to find out his name. I'm going to have a serious talk with Miss Dawson. After healing my daughter, she accursed us. Today, Amanda would talk, take David to an orphanage in North Carolina and leave him for a while. Oh, I must be David. Okay. So that's why I was in an orphanage. It's dangerous for him to be near his sister right now. We'll pick him up after we perform the banishment ritual. I hope it won't take too long. Guess that's it. Uh, yeah, buddy. And then he just walks right the back into this crap. Basement key. So after being safe, we then walk back into the nest. Okay, key, 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 key. What is there? Any other locked doors? I'm just gonna try, cat. So we got F, E, D, C, so A, B, C, D, E, F. Bad. Okay. B, yeah. Okay, never would have guessed that. I had to brute force my way through that one though because I could not find any kind of clues to help me figure out what be I would never have guessed that be a axe. I saw that over here, right? Oh hi. Okay, yeah. Figured that was coming. Oh wow, there's like blood all over that too. That is F. Now I have a sneaky suspicion that Lily's gonna try and stop me. Look at me just cutting it down like a boss. Wait, why did I give that up? Uh, I have a key. Thank you. Axe should be still in my inventory. I don't know why it's not. That's depressing. Oh, almost as depressing as going down these stairs because I know I'm going to get the crap scared out of me. Oh, that's... Looks terrible. Holy shit. Okay, you little bitch. Okay. I'm okay. Okay, everything's good. Everything is good. 
Everything is good. I know there's something over there, but... Okay. What the hell? Oh my god, there's another thing. Oh, I can skip on those noises. What the fuck am I walking into? If someone finds me, I'll let her run away from this house, or you will be torn apart by the terrible evil that lives in my daughter, who tried to perform a ritual of exorcism of this demon. But he understood our plan and killed everyone except me. The demon kept me alive because he needed the, that one who would take care of him. I can't escape from this house. This evil has entered my mind and my thoughts are out of my control. The only way out is to end my... Oh, wait, oh. The only way out is to end up my life in those bright moments when my sanity comes back to me. Okay. What the hell indeed? Oh, this is effed up. This is beyond effed up. Backyard door key. Okay. Oh, this is like a whole slaughterhouse type deal. I do not have the puzzle piece for that one. Oh, here's storage. God. So was the mother just getting bodies to feed to the daughter? Is that what what was going on here? Oh shit. The door's open. this crap oh shh. okay well that okay well that did nothing okay okay oh you throw body parts oh I guess that does make sense not what I first thought it was for but it definitely makes sense now. This is a key, right? I have no idea. It's probably gonna be more bodies back here. Or graves, maybe? Or another house? What the hell? Another house? Is this the old lady's house? Mrs. Dawson? I think her name was. Another key? Why are we... Why is there another house? I've kind of had it with the first house. I don't think I want to go into a second one. I love... N.E. I don't know what the hell N.E. is. Oh my gosh. This game definitely has gotten some pretty good fights out of me. This has to be a stall sense. Look at this crap. Oh, what the hell? We went with Lily's father to Miss Dawson's house. Hi, I was right. And it was a big mistake. She performed all her rituals in the astral world. Having crossed the threshold of this house, we find ourselves in a different reality. And now we are prisoners of this house. I managed to find out that each demon has its own haven in the other world. If we find this demon's home, then we can find Lily's soul. 
to interrupt the ritual, we need to steal an occult book and a ritual knife from the witch, with which she gave birth to this evil, and destroy the manuscript by piercing it with a knife, right in a demon's halls where the soul is hidden. May the Lord help us. Okay. David, is this stuff from 2003? So it's been 20 years since my father and the priest died here. My mother's mind was controlled by a demon all these years until she killed herself a week ago. Now I understand why my parents' house changed when I woke up. I entered the astral world, but why didn't the witch complete the ritual in so many years? I had to finish what my parents started and save your sister. Okay, so that's my father, I take it. What the hell? So, I need to find the book. A, a ritual knife and then stab that book while in the demon's house. Oh, this is ass. That has a lock on it. I definitely... Can I upgrade this? Can I get rid of this dinky little candle? Take a, like a, a big old lamp. Oh, I freaking hate dolls. This is going to be one room I freaking hate. Yeah, I... I knew this was going to be one room I hate. Oh, I knew this was going to be one room I hate. I hate dolls. Alright, so we're gonna go up and just get everything we can out of Okay. So we have to find a bloody ritual book and a knife. Bloody ritual book and a knife. Bloody ritual. VHS is set, that's old school. Still nothing. No ritual book, no knife. Finding stuff that's kinda helpful? Kinda not really. Oh, and the damn doll disappeared. Oh, and I see the TV. Damn it. Well, that doll is going to scare the crap out of me. And I'm going to hate this game just for that. Yep. Bring on the scares, man. Bring on the scares. Oh, what's going to be on this TV? Oh, okay. I saw like the little U. Uh, a pickaxe looking thing. Hey. So I think I know the code. Do we want to enter that code? I, I highly doubt it, but why pickaxe this weird thingy up here? Holy crap. That was right. Holy crap. That was right. Okay. Oh, and it's saving. Oh, I do not like the fact that it's saving like that. Oh, you bastard. Anything useful here? So he stabbed the book. Oh, it bled, but that wasn't the right book. So we see an attempt of him stabbing the book to free the... Lily or something. Change to preventing as well. They would do that. I'm gonna need a what? A bolt cutter? This is getting very... Very Resident Evil kind of vibes. Holy crap. Oh. 
Okay, well. It's not going to work. Oh, well, that is definitely not going to work. He can't open doors, can he? Oh, thank goodness. You? What am I supposed to do here? Yeah, I trust me. I'm not forgetting you guys. Oh, ah, there we are. That was the issue. I had to go close. Blowing. What the hell? Ritual talisman. Okay, well that is terrible. So be careful of the giant fat guy because he will eat you. Is that the only thing I needed down here? No, oh, okay, wait. Wait, I'm kind of confused on how this house is working. Oh, maybe not indeed. missing another bone guess you have to go out to the yard dig up a bone what the hell these puzzles are something else oh that effing damn doll again has a key on his back Child's drawing. So behind the shed. Okay, behind the shed. That gives me an idea of where I need to dig at least. So I need to get out of here. Go behind the shed. I will see you in just a moment. All right, so we're back. I'm finally out here. Going behind the shed. And digging. To then get a bone, which might then get me the key, which then might... Unseal the doll. Well, that's the key. So I got the key first. Okay, I was expecting to find the bone. And then the key. Let me just check over here and make sure there's nothing else I have to dig or find or bullcrap. Yes. Oh. I'll find a toy. Oh, and the music drops. Oh, lovely. Ritual bone. Still don't know what the, what the battery's for, but. Okay, maybe. to do here okay that's what that does yeah I, I don't think i'm ready for this level of f i think i need to get behind that door the fat guy is guarding because i feel like that's the demon realm but the book maybe even the ritual knife that we need it you stab said book has to be being guarded by that fat boy. So we're gonna have to find a way past them. Ok, 
Okay, he's walking, he's walking. I'm hoping I can sneak behind him. He's going to the other side. Faster, faster, faster. Oh, we got in. Oh, crap, we got in. That's not good. I don't like that anymore. Okay, got the occult book. Got the battery box? What the hell is this gonna do? I, I, I don't, I have no idea what's supposed to even go in here. I'm pretty even begin to fathom. I no idea what's supposed to go in here. Oh, that's lovely. That's also lovely. Oh, I was really hoping to be one and done with this room. Right there, okay, so we gotta go the other way. Okay, I got the ritual book, which is a win. Let me just check if there's anything else I might have been missing in any of these rooms. Oh, I hated this freaking bathroom. This room is done. I guess I can put the bone in and see what happens. Maybe I have to get the ritual dagger from this other realm. I don't know, but that's the only thing I can think about. Oh, this seems like ass. Lord, the blood of this family comes to it. What? She missed my blood. Oh. I need to get out of here. I was not supposed to be in here. Oh, I was not supposed to be in here. So I have a human heart. Maybe I'm supposed to stick that in the zappy tool thing. How ah, was the heart? I was beating. Oh, I. That's why I didn't want to deal with this heart. I need to know good as I feel like these hallways are getting longer too. The more progress I make, I feel like the stuff is getting farther and farther away. Could just be my depth of perception. I'm willing to bet, but my god. Hey, who? We are somewhere. Oh, nope. I was not supposed to do that. Nope. Bring me back. Are we 
we're supposed to just keep running around in circles? Is it one of those kind of mechanics? Yes, it is. Oh, you a ghost. Oh, you are one hell of a ghost. What the F? I'm floating. We have to be getting close to the demon's home. Oh yeah, I think we're pretty getting close to the demon's home. Am I supposed to guess? What the? How am I supposed to do here? What? I need to figure out how to open this. Um. Okay, so I see an E kind of symbol, you know, a Y. Oh, wait. Oh, hey. You expect me to really, like, think here. So I need to figure out which one. Say this one. Can I get a hint? Uh, I think it was that one to the right. Yeah, it's a little weird. Well, that one only has four. Yeah, I have no idea how to solve this. So why isn't the dollar sign to be to the right? And then K to the left, maybe? Okay. Holy crap, these puzzles are very intricate. Definitely some Resident Evil puzzles. Figure in the form of a pyramid. Great. Something else I have no idea what the hell to do with. Wait a minute, I saw a door in the basement of my parents' house with a picture of the same pyramid. Did we? I don't remember that. Oh, I do remember that. It's one of those locked doors. Okay. Oh, wow, that's a far away. All right, well, I will see you back there unless something eventful happens. All right, so we're back. We're back. We're... In a pyramid put in place, and holy crap, there's more bodies. There's so much carnage. Oh, okay, I think we might be reaching the conclusion of our destination. Oh, is that our sister? Book? Yes. Stab the book. Stabby. Stabby stab. Thank gosh. Please don't go kill him in that demon. Where's our sister? We just leave? Is this good? Are we good? Are we good here? Are we good? Yeah. We're good. Let's go. Mission accomplished. We saved our sister. Hopefully. And saved ourselves also, hopefully. And everyone's just gonna be happy, right? Happy endings. Oh, six months later.
See, there you go. 